Hey guys, welcome to Tuesday Night Bites, where I snack on Tuesdays. Before we start, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell notifications so you guys don't miss any future episodes. Today, I'm going to be unboxing and eating Lotus Biscoff cookies. Now, they look like that, and if you guys have done any sort of traveling in the U.S. via airplane, you might find these cookies familiar because... I guess in 1986, they started offering Biscoff cookies on a few U.S. flights, and now a majority of the domestic U.S. flights serve these as treats. So if you want these cookies and you're on a trip, definitely ask for them. Now, Lotus has been around since 1932, and on the front it says, Small cookie, unique taste. And on the back, it says, how can a small cookie taste so great? The story of Lotus Biscoff starts in 1932 in a local bakery in Lembeek, a Belgian town. The unique recipe was brought to perfection with carefully selected natural ingredients. Today, Lotus Bakeries is still family owned and based in its hometown. And from there, the tasteful cookies continues to conquer the world. Its secret, its unique flavor, iconic shape, and crunchy bite. For many, it's their cup of coffee's best companion. For others, it's an irresistible treat on its own. How do you like it best? Product of Belgium. Now the serving size is four cookies and it is 150 calories per, per serving. Just a handful of natural ingredients, no artificial colors, flavors, or preservatives. Non-GMO, vegan friendly. So let's get into these. I think I tried this on a flight when I was a, a kid and uh, I liked them so much that I've been looking for them outside of traveling and I didn't realize until fairly recently that they sold this in stores. But you're going to open it and it's going to look like that. And you're going to take, oh, I cracked one. going to have their logo name. Mmm. I really do love these. It's just a unique brown sugary cookie taste. It almost tastes like a gingerbread cookie, to be honest. I'm definitely going to have to eat this with a cup of coffee. I'm not going to do that right now because it's a little after 4.30 and I want to sleep tonight. Mm -hmm. I'm going to keep eating a few of these, but that is my snack for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any snack suggestions, leave them in the comment section down below. If you've had these cookies before, let me know what you think of them in the comment section as well. And yeah, I'll talk to you guys next week. Bye.